It's hard being a high elo player sometimes. I cannot put myself in the shoes of a low elo player and know what exactly to tell them and help them climb the ranks. So I was thinking I could go undercover and buy coaching. But as you guys know, coaching nowadays is a jump scare. If you wanna get good coaching, you might not know where to go. Like, coaching prices are insane. And to that, I have an answer. Tapping.gg And here I am on my trusty Tapping.gg undercover saying it's gold for on a completely brand new account so I can give you guys an experience only you will get like anyone else. No bias. Let's just assume I'm a random Drew to the viewer, shit stack gold, silver. You know, I wanna see how I would get coached if I was you. Like, I, I don't wanna like coach anyone, I don't wanna play duo. I wanna see how is the experience from the coaches on this side. So I'm gonna click on the uh, find match and I'm gonna wait for my coach. Surprise! And here as you can see, we got our coach. And I, I just had to wait 15, 20 seconds, reasonable time. Now we are gonna exchange few words with Big Daddy and then we will get into a game. I will not talk. I will just let him pilot me like a puppet to see how truly knowledgeable those coaches are. Hello, master. Let's get into the game, shall we? I'm a hot stack gold top main. Please unstack me, master. Okay, see you guys in the game. I just got yeah, yes you can, you can. I I'm not <laughs> He can't, he, he can't hear me talk. Oh my god, he can't hear me talk. Hello guys, this is gonna be a different format than usual videos because I didn't talk in the game and he had no idea it was me. I was perfectly undercover. So I'm gonna comment on everything he says that is worth commenting on in this format. So I hope you guys don't mind. And is Kami a good champ? Yeah. I mean, it's not the best one, but it's like A tier, you know? Is there any H good Camille players in high elo? In SGI in top lane you can find. He explain uh, most of matchups in top lane. Oh my ego. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's him, but... I hate Sion. I hate Sion. <laughs> yes, fuck that champion! Fuck that champion! Lily only losers I mean, play Sion. So, so played. I mean, that's... So here we get Darius matchup and... If the coach was actually stupid and not a top liner, he would recommend me to go Grass, which is Omega bait into Darius. You wanna go Conqueror and Alin, and watch what he says. I mean, Conk Con is good. If you play Flash Ignite, it's good, but uh, yeah, your runes are good. Your runes yes, are good. yes, smart. You don't wanna go, like, you don't wanna go Grass into Darius because, like, you wanna Alin often. Just you can uh, switch Bone Plate and, uh, and Second Wine. Yeah, that's that's the because if you just do one auto attack, you can sustain so much and bone plate won't. Okay, so here he actually told me to go second win instead of bone plating because it's smart. I am a greedy piece of shit, so I will still go bone plating, but it's actual good matchup advice. You wanna go second win into Darius? I mean, Trinity is really really good because I I love it. I love to play Trinity against uh, Darius. Especially with Conqueror. I mean, Base. if you add Grasp, Trinity is a uh, win trading. Yes, smart. yes, 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 smart. Fuck Grasp with Trinity. Uh, with Conqueror, it's so good. You should go Trinity, yeah? And you have a very nice champ in, into their comp. You should be careful to not go in the tree bush. You don't know if he can. Yes, you. yes. I, I wanted him to say that. I would like face check nice. this by myself. This is actual insane advice that will win you a lot of games. You don't want to contest champions like Darius level 1 in the tree bush. It's worth to give up some auto attacks on the leash just to arrive to lane safely. And it's just like, it will save you so many games. Yeah, that's free. Don't do much. Okay. Nice. Just wait, he works. Okay. You can auto attack him with passive he, if he works up to auto attack. Nice. Oh, that was bad by me. Take level 2 on the melee. Uh, I, I, will, I will take E. Be safe. 
Because you don't know what happens in his head. He can flash in you and crazy. Nice. That's a nice W. Always wait to get damage. I mean, never W when you have life. Yes, yes, because kill. So you can sustain. Ma maxima, maxima is the thing. Just play safe. Try to get most minion you can. Wave is coming to you, so you are safe. You are near your turret, you can maybe trade him with Q, auto Q. If he works up. Nice, nice one. Okay. E, okay, go, go back. Nice. Now, I'm playing to you can kill him when you have E. Good. Because okay, he okay, I will e. align him once That's I have E. Very nice. Oh, yeah. When you have E, you can go in. Yeah. <laughs> I have it on the wrong nice. spells! W. I'll play bro. Just, I don't think you needed to flash. Yeah. I, I, I didn't know if you did that on purpose. Okay. I panic. You can back, you can back, 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 back. Back? Just take one minion and back. What by? What by, uh, Shin? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Uh, don't back, don't back, don't back, don't back. Don't back. Wait, fucked. Like, mi minion went under turret. So here he tells me to stay on this wave instead of recalling, which is also something that most people won't do. Like, if I recall here, I actually lose more than I just gain by overstaying. Like, in situations like this, it is important to just YOLO it and pray for the best instead of recalling. Because if I recalled, I would lose so much XP and gold that the solo kill on Darius that I got really wouldn't matter and you would be back to being even. Which is really bad because you want to extend your advantage after killing someone. So this is actually really good advice by him uh, telling me to stay and overextend a ping level. That's actually smart from me. I think Lowy looks That's the problem of Kami. In early game, you can't really manage well your way. With other champs, you could maybe force the crash. Yep, Camille's biggest weakness in laning is not being able to shove a wave. You cannot shove a wave when you're behind, and you cannot shove a wave when you're ahead. So it's really hard to extend advantages with her. Just play your, your wave, just play your wave. Okay. If Tarus, just push, just push, just push. You can go from turret, yeah, like this. Think uh, you're coming? Nice, nice, very nice. You might, okay, okay, please uh, plan. Nice. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> you don't have much mana. Be aware. Okay, nice. Go, go. I don't think you kill. Yeah. Just, just run, just run. You can back in the bush, is there? <laughs> <laughs> just back, just back. Just, just go... Just go... Roam mid, roam mid, roam mid. Okay, let's roam. I mean, uh, I mean, you shouldn't dive. I mean, you, you can, but it's risky, like... Oh, but I mean, you can go now. That's free kill. You spent with Q. Nice. Nice, well play. You can back. He's not pushing. Oh, you can help. Level 6. Nice, he's gonna air. E. Nice, well play. So here I was typing to him that I will go dive Kaisa, and then he was like, what the fuck, are you stupid, don't? at start when she was full HP because it was really a psycho of play but because I am so confident with Camille I knew that I could outplay it but for an average Andy it wouldn't be possible which is good advice to stay away from the dive but the second he sees that Syndra gets a favorable trade against Kaisa he's like go 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 eat her just try to W first yeah, like this and second Q nice no okay you, you just kill the <laughs> oh my god, I can fucking. <laughs> okay, art push, you, you take the right. I have. Art push, art push. I can just it. one shot the right. Oh my god, I, I am mean, wrong! You don't have to so... go for tricks. Like, uh, in, this, in this situation, you just have to play classic and. You just did. 
Little does he know, I wanted to play normally and calm and not flash, but I fat fingered flash instead of ignite, so GG, you know why. Yep, and you got... You are playing uh, Alakrichi, so you don't have a piece of, uh, of tenacity. Yep, this is a big mistake most Camille players make and just ruins their win ratio. If you have Alakrichi in your Concorde setup, and they have any form of CC, it's always better to go Mercs than Tabis because even if they have 5 AD champions but they have CC and you have Alacrity, you will need this tenacity and it will save your life. You can go anywhere, you want to your own. Wait, he's there? Okay, okay, he's not there. Uh, pink top lane, so Syndra go top. I mean, maybe she go alone, but... Yes, that's smart to tell my mid laner to go top. I mean, that's weird. I don't know if that's weird or she's just bad. Okay, get a shield. And when you have E, you can... Uh... Just E, wait, E, e out? Nice, boy, you're smuffing. You can fight your shield. Nice. E. Bro, oh, you're smurfing. You're not good. Nah, nah, you, you're lying. You're not good, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you're playing good, bro. Get a long sword for it. Long sword. Shoot to get more speed. That's uh... Okay. I mean, nice, you kill him, but you could have killed him. Okay, sustain? Ah, you don't have sustain, never mind. You didn't finish right. Nice. Uh, the problem is. Yeah, 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 it's fine, it's fine to go. Don't go Zira. But I was talking about Ezreal. You, wait, run, run, run. You should have... Uh, you know when you went in vision on him, you should have wait to get your E back to show yourself, you know? Because he, he wasn't going away if you don't show you up. The tip he's giving is really advanced, but it only applies pretty much to like higher heroes like Diamond and above, where enemies play around timings of every single champion and enemy team. But in lower heroes, the Ezreal wouldn't really track how much time it would take me to get bot, so it was just better to run at him because there's no way he didn't uh, he knew that uh, I had no E but what he wanted me to do is just stay out of vision until me my E comes back up so the Ezreal has no chance of escaping can just go go hard on Echo just E him fuck him he's dead E it's your bitch he's uh... Q, boom! Nice. Okay, e. Auto Q. Nice, okay, no flash. Ping it. I mean, you won't have Herald, but you got free per kill, I guess. Now, what you gonna you wanna do? Press tab? Okay, Syndra doesn't have TP, but never mind. You just play. Just go top, just go. He just explained top lane macro in one sentence. He told me to press tab to check if Syndra has TP, but since Syndra doesn't have TP, there is nobody that can go side, so it doesn't really matter where I am, unless I am bot lane. That's, that would be a bad play, but he just like wanted to check if Syndra has TP, which is a good macro decision, because if your mid laner has TP, they can side, because he knows Darius and Kai'Sa have no teleport, so they can't contest objectives. No, she's dead. Go, 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 go on it, go on it, ping, ping on it, pick it. Yeah, but uh, you can't pick anymore. I mean, it's so na it's so free nash. Ping help. <laughs> you insect. Yeah, but doesn't matter if you are Iron Shitter or Jesus Christ of League of Legends, your teammates will not listen to good calls, but this is like literally how you end games in lower elos, because in lower elos games tend to last longer. 
and the way to end them is well Nashor, but everyone is scared of Nashor in lower elos. The second you get a like two peaks or a, or a jungler kill, you should always ping Nash, no matter how behind or ahead you are. The numbers are just like if it's just simple math, you should always do Nash if enemy jungle is dead or two people. <laughs> Ping help Nash again, like spa spam it, spam it. J just five ping, count, just five. So you don't get blocked, that's uh, tricky. Okay, now wait five seconds and do five again. <laughs> okay, wait, this is, I didn't know do, this. If you do six, you wait! get the same of ping. Oh my god, this, okay, real coaching. I am so glad I made this video just so I learned optimal spam ping rotation so you have to pee you have limit of five pings per five seconds and if you ping six times you get put on a 10 second cooldown so if you want to tell someone to kus kus you just do it five times uh and then you wait five seconds and then you can like optimal rotation it's actually like it's actually something i didn't know and i will probably use for the rest of my life thank you this guy, wait, he's going for... Nah. Max rope, I'm a rope maxi, I'm hook maxi. Yeah, this guy just... Oh wait, he's going for wolves? Nah. Help me win, Zach! You can't even watch me, you pierdolo! It's just too weird. Okay, nice. Don't forget you have a smite. Kek. Haha, choke a fool. Fuck that bitch. Okay. I don't think he want to go. Yeah, wait a stack, wait a stack. I mean, it's fine. You can get fun. I mean, game is over. You, you should buy uh, GA, GA. stopwatch G and a uh, pot. Yep, that's it. That's smart. I would buy BF Sword personally, but he knows that buying stopwatch is much more efficient because stopwatch active can literally like change the outcome of a game uh, compared uh, uh, to like a couple of extra AD. You should end this game on the next Nash. Your error on the fight was to not sidestep the... Nice. Q. Nice. Just, just end the game. I mean, you can uh, go with this bitch. And this guy, damage. You still have Stirak. Nice. GG. GG, bro. GG. <laughs> GG. GG. You think? Like you if did. If I lost, lost lane, what do what I do? Think? do? If I lost lane, what do I do? I can just roam bot and kill. People. Depends what happened exactly. Like if. It takes the turret, you have a multiple choice. You can make a freeze in front of your chair too, you know? That's an easy spot to, to make a freeze and to deny him. So if you freeze him, that means he was roaming, okay? Okay. But if not, you just take the CS under your Chi2. You don't want to let your Chi2 fall down. Because it gives so much gold. Okay. You take Chi2, and if he's roaming, you you can decide. You freeze him, or I you can roam as well. You I push wave the and roam. When I want to reaction my voice. Uh, Kami doesn't need to be overfed to roam, you know? Because Bro, you have uh, utility. E and R, easily easy catch, you know? Just push the wave and run mid, E, R, uh, yeah, go back to like top, get the honestly. wave. Okay, watch this, watch this chat. Do you watch know what I mean? Guys. Okay, thank you, I will use this advice. What? What?
<rire> oh putain j'ai mal <rire> Wesh <rire> Oh putain Attends wait wait <rire> I mean I even change your video <rire> yeah. Oh putain I'm crying bro <rire> oh. Non mais je vais <rire> Uh, that I, ironically, a good coaching session. You're actually pretty good. Like, holy shit, bro. <laughs> I mean, I, I learned from you, to be honest, on Kami. Yeah, I, I wanted to say, what, like, if I wanted to ask you who can I learn action from, but I think you would get, the, like, you, you would know it's me at that point. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. I, I was so scared you got, like, you realized that it's me when I, like, killed three people bot. Because I forgot, I wanted to do, like, I didn't want to do like advanced mechanics, but yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, I mean, I saw you were uh, trying to int with those flash. Yeah. In because I, I was flashing non-stop, like because I play with flash on D, not on F. Okay, okay. Yeah, That's what the fat finger flashes came from. Uh, I when I, I I saw your play bot, I was like, wait. Yeah, this guy isn't gold. Is, <laughs> this guy is gold, like. <laughs> okay, thank you for the session, bro. I enjoyed it very uh, much. Ah, uh, that was very funny, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Have an <laughs> enjoyable day. Uh, thank you, bro. Thank you, See thank you. you. See you, bro. See you. And now, after the session, I can end it. Finish. I can give the coach a five star because I actually enjoyed it. I think the coach provided reasonable, reasonable coaching. Like because this guy didn't know until I revealed that was me, by the way. So if this is like your average coaching on this side for fifteen dollars, like I would like obviously I would do better. No ego, but like this was, this was really good. I really enjoyed it. I really enjoyed it, and he was really smart and he gave reasonable advice that most people like. It's more like you can see this guy is a top laner like not only because he's like you know a jacksman but you can see from his knowledge and everything that he's actually a really good player and uh, i enjoyed it very much i enjoyed it very much it was very fun and uh, if i was not obviously one of the best players in the us this would be a valuable session and it only costed me 13 dollars 13 dollars for this coach do you want to pay $13 for a guy that knows this much? Or do you want to pay $350 and then fucking your ass? It's just like, not even a choice. This is like, amazing. Like, I, I, I wish I knew about this like, when I was low elo, but obviously it didn't exist when I was low elo. But still, it was like an amazing session, guys. Like, I really enjoyed it and it was really good, knowledgeable. And I will, uh, I would gladly do it again. I would gladly do it again. Like, undercover. Now I'm gonna show you guys how to order it. So basically, you go on tapping.gg, you have to register, then you edit you you, your in-game username, server, rank, and your preferred roles. I recommend choosing only one role, for uh, so you get a specialist. And then you click co-pilot, this is coaching, $13 for a game, and I am sure most of them would uh, be happy to review it as well. Then you select your role. Then you click find match and boom and you find the coach so yeah make sure to check out tapping gg once again thank you for sponsoring this video but unironically i would recommend it it's really good like because this is just me clicking on the first coach ever and getting this kind of experience from a player that competes against me in high elo uh it's it's great it's actually a really good session so thank you guys for watching and hope you enjoyed the video leave a like comment and make sure to again to check out tapping.gg thank you guys and have a nice day